Hello, everyone. I'm Erin Hardick, Lead Research Analyst at C-Prime. I am joined virtually today by two guests for a new C-Prime panel interview. I'm joined by Dr. Michael Weber, author of Power Trip and recurring Z-Prime guest, I believe, and the director of the new PBS Amazon Prime series, Power Trip, which was an adaptation of Dr. Weber's book. Uh, Matt Haynes. So, Dr. Weber, thank you for joining me. My pleasure. Thanks for having me. And Matt, thank you for joining me for your first time. Thanks for having me. So, I wanted to warm up a little bit, put you guys on the spot with um, a round of rapid fire questions. This is a new thing that we're doing at Z Prime, kind of get you guys loose, and hopefully, you don't turn against each other. So, what I mean by that is normally we would just have one guest and I would ask them a question and they would answer rapidly. But this time I'm going to ask both of you questions and or I'm going to ask one question and you have to say the name of the person that you think is the most likely to um, do that thing or, or be that person. I think you'll get the hang of it uh, when I start asking the question. So all you have to do is say the name, either your name or the other person's name. Okay, if you think it applies to you or the other person. Does that sound good? Sure, that sounds good. Okay. It sounds rife with the possibility of us getting angry with each other. Yeah, this, we might have a throw down, let's see how it goes. Okay, I have about six or seven questions for you. So with that, we'll get started with our quick speed round. Okay, who drinks more coffee? Matt. Me. Who talks more? Me. Michael. <laughs> Who's always ready to take lunch first? Who's always ready to what? To take lunch first, to go to lunch. Oh, Ty. Yeah, we both like lunch. Yeah. Who's we, more of a perfectionist? Uh, different, uh, Matt, probably. He has a filmmaker, he has to make a perfect film. I think he's more of a perfectionist. Who watches more TV? Matt. Me. Who is more likely to be late? Me. You're welcome. And last question, who is a bigger nerd? Uh, I'd say me, uh, but in different ways. Matt's got his own nerd credentials, just in a different discipline, I think. Yeah, I, I definitely think we both have that one. It's probably a tie. A tie. Um, to expand on that a little bit more, Dr. Weber, what would you say? What, um, where does your nerd dumb fall? My nerd didn't falls within the world of like engineering and science, and Matt will know all sorts of like uh, really specific cultural references or TV shows or books that other people don't know. So I think we have different nerd depths, just different disciplines. Yeah, I would say that Michael's nerddom expands pretty far, though. I mean, he could definitely hang talking with movies and music and culture. Um, so it, he's not just a in that realm. I might add a little bit of like. 70s art rock and random bizarre movie knowledge and things like that. 